to Abe's. Thanks for clicking on this video. Today we are recapping One Piece episode 194. Came out Saturday. I'm making this on Tuesday. I know I've been slacking, all right? But technically today's Wednesday. It's like two o'clock in the morning. I was thinking about you guys. Okay, in this episode, there's a lot, all right? It's subtle things, but there's a lot. Frankie, Usopp, Sanji, Robin, Nami, they have arrived on the island. Zoro and Brooke stayed back. You know, Zoro don't, he's the responsible one. He needs to protect the ship. Brooke agreed with him, so they just stayed behind. Lydis took them to Egghead Island. As y'all seen, if y'all seen this episode, she basically is trying to test her new pacifista. It's freaking Jimbe. That's, that's crazy. That's going to be an OP pacifista. I think it's probably gonna be better than Kuma, because obviously Jinbei is stronger than Kuma. Don't 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 fight me in the comments. All right, I know you I know you, I know you just went down to the comments after I said that. Relax. Bonnie freaking turned everybody into little kids. Why does Jinbei have blonde hair? But when he was a kid, he had black hair, right? Like, why is there blonde? I'm confused. Like, how how does that work? She turned Luffy into an old old man that. Luffy is just, he's still stupid, but he's 85 years old. It's the funniest thing. Chopper got turned into an old dude, too. It's just, why did she turn them old and Jinbei young? Like, I, I get, oh, I don't know. I don't know. Why did she do that? Jinbei's like, what, 30 or something? I guess he would have been dead. I don't know. I don't know how power works yet. They're going to explain it, I'm pretty sure. But I know coming up next, the next episode is probably going to be Kuma's backstory. Kuma was an ugly kid. I ain't gonna lie. Kuma looks ugly to me. All right, don't attack me. He he looks ugly to me. Apparently, this is what I've heard. I've heard spoilers. It's very sad. His backstory is sad and and it's heartwarming. I don't. I would you gonna have to see? There wasn't no fights in this episode. They were just showing the straw hats being straw hats, stupid, goofy. Robin being very very morbid. Usopp being scared to walk through a door. After he's seen literally everybody walk through the door. Dragon is in cahoots with Vegapunk? What's going on? Is Dragon not... At the end of the episode, Dragon called up Vegapunk, bro. And it's like, what's going on? Like, does Dragon not know his son is on Egghead now? Like, does he even claim Luffy as his son? We don't know. He grabbed Milk and disappeared from Luffy's life. Luffy doesn't, doesn't even know he had a dad. He don't only had a grandpa. Bro, it's bro, One Piece is getting so juicy. It's so much stuff that's finna happen in these latest episodes, and we have to wait a week every week to get them. And some weeks there'll be filler episodes. Are, are we gonna finally see, see Dragon in action? Are we gonna figure out what his devil fruit power is? I know you guys have theories, but we don't know what his devil fruit power is. We know on Log Town he saved Luffy. It's some type of weather ability. We know that for sure. Does Vegapunk know what his devil fruit is? Does literally anybody else know what his devil fruit is? How is he in cahoots with Vegapunk? Apparently, Vegapunk is dying. He's dying. And is that why he split his his personalities into multiple people? Because he doesn't want to die without completing his research? Bro got the, the, the COVID disease and Dragon knows. Dragon knows who Vegapunk is. I don't think he know that. Luffy's on Egghead. I don't know. Lily, I don't know if she betrayed the Straw Hats. I think she's just testing to see if the Pacifista would be stronger than that or strong enough to fight the Straw Hats. And she's going to be like, hey, hey guys, I'm just testing you guys. You know, I love you guys. I don't know. What, we don't know what's going on. Other than that, dweebs, that's pretty much it in the recap. I mean, there's not a lot of fighting is going on yet, but y'all have to wait. Because as y'all know, Luffy is finna get his one back with Kizuru. Law currently, right now, as we are speaking, is fighting Blackbeard. If you have not watched my last recap on that, go watch it. I also did a mukbang. You need to watch that first ever mukbang. All right, I'm fat. Bonnie, is Bonnie ever going to see her father again? Is, is Kuma back after Sabo saved him? Is he back? They completely turned my dude into a robot. Bonnie said he would never do something like that. So did he do that in order to save her life? Like, why, he, why would he go with the program to become a cyborg and augmentation? We don't know. Nobody knows. You guys have to know this is the best anime of all time. You have to know this by now. If you haven't watched One Piece, why are you watching this recap video? You're getting spoiled. Click off my video and go watch my other video. I love you, though. Just don't watch this video. You're going to get spoiled. Anyway, dudes, that's basically it in this recap. I love you guys. I see you guys in the next one. Ugly Road TV, we out.